What's up guys? Uh, it's a boy again, yeah, I'm Slink and I'm an honorable friend here at Free West Deep Entertainment Industry. Um, did I introduce you well? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, uh, he's going to be joining me to discuss uh, about the stuff we already discussed, just to bring his, his own idea. And uh, we're going to be looking at uh, Pastor Toby being uh, recently investigated for fraud, then he was savage, being called a lujo because of uh, the kind of advices yeah, he's giving. Kind of, you know. Then uh, we're going to look at other stuff as well, and uh, Bonobo as well. So let's start with uh, Tiwa Savage being called a Losho. You know, the other day, there was this Kenya socialite who said Tiwa Savage sleep with men yeah, for yeah. money. Mm. Of course, we defended her. How can Tiwa Savage who has so much money now, got to sleep with men for money? Like, without much, Tiwa Savage will do it again. Until when she came on stage to categorically state that although she has her own money, but it feels good for a man to also buy your stuff. Yes. That if you must match her energy, you must also match her fund. Fund, not F U N. F U N D. Fund. You must also match her money. So. What's the need of de defending somebody, someone who is selling, saying all this kind of stuff? You know, there is no point because when I I saw a lot of videos from Tiwa Savi talking about um, men, uh, you ladies, you have to go after men that uh, has money. Has money. But one thing co uh, comes up in my mind, like according to statistics by Bureau of Statist uh, Statist um, this is statistics report across the world. Uh. 1% of the population they are rich. You understand? Mm -hmm. So now, are you saying all the girls in the world should go for that one population, 1% one of this population that are rich that are rich, and they should abandon the others? So based on those kind of advice, Tiwa Savage is losing one thing that she is a role model to many people. Do you know that Tiwa Savage at the time, she was a role model to families, not just yes, now that's no, why no, no, no. I have right got she that has... a pampas deal. Yes, and you know, portraying this calm you know, girl, and, uh, you know, but but, but no, but she, sometimes and sometimes she's destroying a, a lot of heartbreaks. A lot of heartbreaks. Not the only she that break break out to because of stuff. Uh, but you have to you have to keep some words with you. Advising women now because they don't break your heart. See this. You you notice say other girls they succeed. You understand? Because you are not successful in your own relationship does not mean that other younger guests are not succeeding in their relationship. So that is it. If you don't want to like go with uh, this thing, just stay on your own now. Not be people be them or, right now and then. Or, 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 or maybe she just promoting, you know, just to catch crews on stage. But that is not, not how because somebody I you know I think I read the comment. This Guy is an elderly person. He said Tiwa Savage has lost her brand as a role model to families. You understand? Some people go, they allow their children those days, they watch her music, they listen to her music. You understand? But now people are no longer after the S T P issue and the rest, and people are no longer. But now, but, 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 but now that. she's making more money, man. No, she no she's definitely more money. No, she's definitely about the more money. Okay. So whether about... whether children papa allow uh, children watch uh, music or not, to oh, she she's not about that type of thing. She, okay. She, I believe she has tested uh, tested everything. If a woman can have, uh, have a S T P and not not pursue any criminal charges against the person who released those tape because of the identity of the man you know she's done she's done past that uh, that life uh, that life of being calm or that life of being a victim of victimized she has passed part. yes she's that, that is great. Years but uh, what we are saying right there you know people feel that life is all about the money why does the rich cry you understand if it's all about the money somebody will get money not supposed to commit no, suicide no 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 she's she not so. crying you know, Missy Tiwa. So but that is. She rather cry on she's stage. She's finding a know, lot of things. She, she rather has a, cry. She has stage. a son. See, see, she 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 rather cry on stage, filled with many fans that cry low, not having. Okay, somebody to coming on stage to say she's done with Nigerian uh, men. She's this one, and she has a son that will become a Nigerian man. You know, see, all those people they don't know say what goes around comes. You understand? <laughs> they come. To you, but so it may not come now. You may enjoy it now. Later in life, when you are old and all those frail and this thing, 
those things you said will be counted against you. Okay, then, okay, okay. Let's move talk. back to what's happening. I was saw Bono Boy. Bono Boy needs to check his uh, his um, his uh, Instagram messages because Offset, uh, part of uh, Migos crew, Offset is can be his husband is trying to get get to you so that they can have uh, a collaboration so try as much as possible brother boy to check your message and it's good to see all those artists now eh? they are the one coming going after our own artists all, all, all on like that time we go beg artists we go pay extra like david don't pay mid meal two hundred thousand dollar for a song that don't i don't even think it that's not even make hundred thousand dollars you understand? David don't pay me any money as at that time mm. to feature. But right now, they don't pay dime again. Because you want me as much as I want you. We sing, if we blow, we share royalty and all the rest. That is what uh, you need to understand. That is initial sacrifice. Because a lot of people need to actually pay the sacrifice and then do a lot of things before you can say you don't achieve something. You know, remember the, the time of... Uh, in 1997, the time of Idris Abdul Karim Plantation Boys and all those people who thought that Nigerian music would live offshore, would leave the shores of this country. You understand? So later, it gradually started getting accepted. Do you know that people are now pushing that Afrobeat should be celebrated by BET and Grammy? Yes, because now, Billboard now has yes, a, 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 a list a, for Afrobeat. That is it. So, so people are really Grammy pushing for this and. Uh, Investment Very is soon, on, yes. Grammy will have their specific award for, for Afrobeat Africa. For, 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 for Afrobeat for Africa. Well, the that's actually good to see them uh, coming to us. So let's discuss about one of the trendy issues now, Pastor Toby. Pastor Toby. Of course, you know, we have heard yes, about him. Uh, you, know, that, you know, people refer to that the flashy celebrity pastor. pastor. The flashy pastor. Mm -hmm. So this guy, he said... Uh, his uh, church is no more like a church. It's just like an organization. Well, he, see, you know, it's he, it's not a. You can if if it's, it's not like, like a see, foundation. A a church mm. is like according to how it was written, the how it was registered. It's a charitable organization mm. for promoting life and mm. uh, helping people. So they do not really pay that much of tax. Uh, they are allowed to run freely. Some few freedom. They have more than uh, the usual uh, corporation, mm. but himself, the UK government are thinking this is a corporation because this man is into Bitcoin, is into NFT and other businesses mm. as well. So he might be putting the money through church to make him not to pay uh -huh. more tax about yeah, it. Yeah. And apart from that, eh, his members, past members. I've been complaining about him that this guy is a fraudster. He's duped them. In fact, I have a lot of messages on my DM already because I talk about this Pastor Toby yesterday, and people have messaged me saying, telling me that this Pastor Toby no be asked to say more. This man is a real fraudster. But I cannot read your messages and I cannot blame put allegations there. Yeah, yeah. It's not pending investigation. It's pending uh, investigation. Uh, <laughs> investigation. And people have been coming like, okay, is it that a pastor cannot drive flashy cars? It's not. A pastor cannot wear uh, Gucci. A pastor can. Uh, on, on, on all those stuff. A pastor can. Because it's not produced for any specific uh, set of people. I believe if you are a human being, if you have the means to get it, you can wear it and you like it. So far, you know the offend person. So, like this one, you know, because most people will tell you that uh, I in churches they will tell you that uh, pastor will they fly private jet. If pastor does not fly private jet, who will fly it? Is he not a human being? If you get money, you go fly him, Abi. So well, I think it's different. But state. what the difference is that the source of money that is what they are looking at. UK See. government is not talking about if they live flashy life. What they are talking about. How he has been able to be fund, to fund and all this life. proper bookkeeping. Yes. He's not giving UK government the proper bookkeeping. Bookkeeping. Like, yes. You know, like, like if, if uh, let's say the EFCC now touch like most, um, you know, foundations and, uh, you know, like uh, charity organization in Nigeria, they will still fight the same thing. But most people use this money for charity to fund their own individual lives. That is also 
how it is you know many people um having this organization if you are not a billionaire before you started the, like mm. the gate i don't think uh, a lot of them are really doing the, the proper book, bookkeeping that is what i believe about that so uh they should investigate him and get to understand you know the source of his uh, luxury lives and other things that is what i don't believe okay. well uh well you know um, pastors uh, imam and all those uh, religious worshippers uh, hmm? you know they say follow you should are following the full step of god the, the full step of jesus christ hmm? that means you are trying to be like him mm -hmm. Hmm? So you check out the way he lived his life, giving out charity. A pious man is a man that feels like, okay, I have this phone, mm -hmm. this cloth, this uh, shirt. Mm -hmm. can do the same thing with, with uh, you buying a Gucci shirt, branded mm -hmm. Gucci shirt. It's still to cover my body, right? Yeah, that, that, that wait, takes wait, me wait, to wait, like... Wait, uh, let, <clears> me, <throat> let me, let me... Yeah. It's still to cover my body. Mm. It does the same thing. Mm. It's just that this shirt is what, let me say, 10,000 naira. Mm. And that Gucci shirt is what, you know, drives on the thousand naira. If I'm wearing that Gucci shirt, it's not because to cover my body alone. It's to make a statement. Yes. It's, it's to, to make people forth. be like, ah. Snow yeah. appeal. It's to make people intimidate. Mm. And as Jesus Christ, let me tell you something that you know individuals are very different peter will be um it's very this, different but it does not change the fact i know uh, let me tell you something i want to tell you a story maybe you must have read the story where uh, bianca ojuku spoke about okay. peter will be said they went to uh, a shop to buy expensive suit peter will be said this is too expensive and they went to a lesser place and bought a cheaper one i think about 200 and something dollars so when Peter B was going after the um, the uh, thing, Peter B left the country. When he was going at the airport, he he gave the balance that they were supposed to use to buy that, especially Gucci and all those things, um, all those uh, clothes for this thing. He gave it to um, uh, Ujuku's wife. He used it to help people in need. There are people like that, and that is the best way. That is what I just see as the best way because there's no need for me to wear. 300,000 naira, um, like uh, 300,000 naira t shirt. I'm still working in the street where I see beggars begging money. So people are not being able to pay for school fees, uh, get drugs for themselves. What is the need? Why am I wearing this? Who am I intimidating it for? It's better for me to normal buy five k shirt and give the money. You understand? And circulate it. That is it. Because imagine where everybody keeps helping everybody. This life will be better. That is what well, the part is that he wears those things for intimidation. For intimidation, for like uh, society talks and people, all those things. People, people uh, buy expensive clothes for intimidation, whether we like it or not. I will buy expensive things because I want, not just because to feel good. No. I cannot no. feel good if somebody is not seeing me. Yes. If I'm the only person on this life, I won't see the reason why I would need to wear shit. Mm. But because there are people around me, I would like to wear a shirt, and because there are people who are looking, I would like to wear expensive things for them to see me. So God forgive us all of us, we are still guilty of all of, of, of it. But that's just the fact. Then I let's uh, watch two videos. Uh, this one is just coming from normal Nigerians, mm -hmm. or normal people out there. And this girl is crying for her husband. So guys, I've been in the UK for seven years now, and not a single day has someone stopped me on the road to propose to me so i went to work and i asked my colleagues maybe there was something wrong with me but apparently they started laughing and went <laughs> it's the same thing everywhere so people in the uk i just want to know where do you people find love we want to know we are tired of being single please unsingle us if you approach them huh? mm. they will give you head you understand what I mean? Mm, yeah. They will give you hell. They will make it really difficult for you to know them. Okay, and let me yes. let me tell you one thing. Um, many people have like interacted with single ladies and other things. They are still looking for husband. But you know what they are saying? One of them said uh, she needs a man that will change her car first before she get married. So right now, so what something struck my mind that you are not ready to get married. Maybe when you are ready, you will understand. 
So that marriage, having a boyfriend is not to fund your expensive lifestyle. It's to una go contribute. This one will contribute some things. Come together and decide say, this is where we are going to. So all these people, like this girl, now if you toast her now, she don't agree. She don't say you don't get paper. You don't get paper. Yeah, so oh, she will say she, she, you, you want to use that get paper. Mm, paper. So <laughs> forget it, but forget it. Let them remain single. And they're still talking about depression abroad. Depression abroad. Depression. You just want to be depressed. There are social uh, people you can be, but after all, see, guys be there abroad to uh, our guys be there abroad to they they not not all those guests, Nigerian guests will be there anyhow. Because they feel like there are few there. You no, understand? no, apart from there are few there, like I've interacted with somebody, he said he didn't want to marry them. He said one because most of them when you get married to them because the law is crafted in such a way mm. that give them upper hand mm. uh, against you they will use it to oppress you do you know that they can make you not to work if you wash in plates and doing nanny and, at all. and, and um, yeah they will go in and there are all those white people even treat well, men better better you understand they love better so why do you go for them? Because they already used to the law. They don't yes. the law. But mm. our own people, the go they don't They are not used to it. If it's just like freedom. freedom from... They have to deal with men. Uh -huh. you know? And our own people here, they always want to deal with men. They always want to deal with men. But thank you guys for watching. It's boy again, Adam Slink. And uh, thank you, Free Wednesday, for joining us. Have a wonderful day. Stay blessed. Peace.